So a year is how long it takes for the Earth to orbit once around the Sun. A month is based on the Moon's rotation around the Earth. And a day is how long it takes the Earth to rotate once on its axis. But why is a week 7 days long? There isn't any astronomical reason behind the 7 day long week. Or why we traditionally work for 6 of those days and rest on the 7th. Some say the practice came from market days. But even market days clustered around every 7th day instead of every 15th and 19th or some other day. Others believe that the 7 day week started with Moses and the Ten Commandments. But the people that became Israel and other nations observed the Sabbath long before Moses was alive. Instead, we have to go back to Genesis, where it says God created for six days and then rested on the seventh. And that's how we have modeled our weeks ever since. The Soviets tried to change the week to five days in 1929. But that didn't help productivity and ruined family life since people had different days off from work. Also, machines couldn't handle the constant use and would often break down. So they switched to a six-day week in 1931. But when that didn't work out either, they restored the seven-day week in 1940. Seven just seems to work out better when it comes to days in the week. And that's a great testimony to the fact of creation, that we observe the same seven-day week God established when he first created us.